Is she infected? Looks clean. What do we do? She'll die here. No time. Get her to the car. Hey, can you hear me? It looks like your pupils are responding and your hearing is intact. How are you feeling? When we found you, you had lost a lot of blood. I don't usually believe in miracles, so I assume that your quick recovery is the result of incredible fortitude. Oh, by the way, welcome to Woodbury. I think this is the first time we've ever seen you here. So, you're probably not from around these parts. But don't worry, make yourself at home. So, can you get up? Try to get off the bed. Feeling dizzy. Let me take another look at you. Great. I'm really glad to see you recovering so quickly. We've saved people from the outside before, but we practically pulled you back from the brink of death. My name is Leonard, Woodbury's doctor. And you are? All right. Your speech organs seem fine. Nice to meet you. Well, I'm sure you have a lot of questions, but our leader Chris will fill you in on everything better than I can. So, if you're feeling okay already, you can grab your bag and go take a look around. Don't worry. Everyone in Woodbury already knows we have a newcomer. We found you not far from Woodbury. Bleeding and unconscious. Your car was nearby, overturned, and it looked like you'd been fighting with a large group of infected. It's a good thing we found you in time. Well, anything else? I'm sure Chris will tell you more than I can. You're in the survivor colony of Woodbury. It's the last remaining shelter in New Fortune State. We've been together for a year now. Working together to rebuild our lives in these new circumstances. And so far, luck is still on our side. I'm sure you'll like it here. It's safe and comfortable to live. With enough supplies Shit. for everyone. We even you have our own shops. It's best for you to see everything with your own eyes. And Chris will give you all the details. Too shabby, huh? It's getting better all the time, huh? That's okay. I'll just sell stuff Take care, and get fine. well soon. After you talk to Chris, you can always find me at the infirmary. Don't forget to take your belongings. They're in the bag by the door. Weapons and other equipment you can check out at Archa. And if you need medical supplies, you'll be able to buy them from me when I return to the infirmary. You must have been thirsty. If you go out again, don't forget to replenish your food and water supplies at Rob's Bar.
keep it up. Not only of Woodbury, but of the entire... Hello. You're the survivor we rescued a couple of days ago, aren't you? We were all praying for your speedy recovery. It's good to see you're okay. We always tried to help those in trouble. Otherwise, where would we be if we didn't show humanity to each other? Definitely not here. My name is Chris, and I'm in charge of this shelter called Woodbury. Here, we have gathered all the remaining survivors from New Fortune City and the surrounding suburbs. In Woodbury, we all work together towards rebuilding our society, and any help would be greatly appreciated. Each of us would like to live in a better world. A world where our children can play freely on the streets, where we won't have to live every day in uncertainty and fear of death. This dream is what unites all of us. Get to know the members of our close-knit team to see how everything is organized here. Talk to the weapons trader, Edit, the storage keeper, Abby, the bartender, Ron, and Dr. Leonard. After you're done talking, come back to me, and in the meantime, I'll register you. This is genuine civilization, buddy, and I'm so glad to be here. You have no idea. Greetings, buddy. I see you finally recovered. Let me introduce myself. I'm Eddard, the weapons trader. It was my guys who found you almost dead out there. We don't leave people in distress here in Woodbury. Quite the opposite, actually. Here, I've got something for you. This is the Molot Hunter, an excellent rifle. Just needs to be assembled at the workbench. Once you assemble it, you can have it for yourself. It's a gift. With it, you'll have a better chance of making it back home on your own two feet, rather than on a stretcher like last time. No need to thank me. 
The important thing is that you're alive. The rest doesn't matter. Well, I wish you luck, buddy. If you ever want to buy top-notch weapons and ammunition, or if you want to sell anything you don't need, feel free to come to me. It seems you're still not on the list of residents. Before I can trade with you, you'll need to complete registration with Chris as a new resident. Don't worry, buddy. It's a quick process. See you soon. See you, buddy. As a person who's been Don't underestimate the infected. They may not be the sharpest, but they definitely see and hear you. Hey there. You're the survivor everyone's been talking about lately, right? Glad to see you're okay. I'm Abby, the storage room keeper. It's the safest place in Woodbury, so people use it to store their personal belongings. I can see your backpack is pretty full. Leave the things you don't need right now with me. It'll make it easier for you to move around. Don't worry. They'll be perfectly safe here. It's secure here. Great, that's the way to go. Chris wants you to register as a resident of Woodbury. That's great. We always welcome new members to our community. Just yesterday, we weren't sure if you would be okay. Well, in that case, I need to give you this. It's a GPS map of New Fortune City and its surrounding area. It marks all the evacuation points through which you can safely return to Woodbury. Keep an eye on the map. The closer you are to an evacuation point, the safer it'll be. According to the rules, I need to wait for confirmation from Chris that you're a registered resident. Once you're done with that, feel free to drop by if you need any medication. All right then. See you later. Take care of your health. Come for medication anytime. Lately, I haven't been sleeping. The most harmful thing to help. You know, Dr. Letterman seems... Everything else is totally clear. Imagine. 
for a year now, and there's been no such amount of exhaust and harmful gases from cars and factories as before. We're breathing truly clean air for the first time. It turns out so. Wow. The plants well outside as well. I have never seen them so big and green before. What do you grow in your garden? Tomatoes? What can I say? They see me rolling, they hate me. <clears throat> I'm heading to Rob's bar today. Like everything that's been happening in the past few years, it's just part of some crazy survival show. Hi, what's new? Five years ago, I won $7,000. Hey, look who's awake. Welcome to Woodbury, pal. I'm so happy to finally see you alive. I'm Rob, and here's my bar. So, how are you doing? Enjoying your time here, huh? Actually, Chris warned me that he'd be sending you my way to get to know each other. So, I've prepared a little gift for you. I'm sure it'll come in handy. I kept this first aid kit for myself, but, uh... I haven't been out in a while, and I like you, so take it. Maybe it'll save your life again someday. So, did Chris get you registered already? When you're done, swing by here. I always have good food, drinks, and supplies in case you're heading out. We'll catch up again, pal. Have a great day. bloomed well outside as well. I have never seen them so big and green before. What do you grow in your garden? Hi there. You don't have to worry. The safety of Woodbury. Great. I see you've met everyone. So, what do you think of Woodbury at first glance? It's good to hear that. It took a lot of effort to make Woodbury what it is. I hope our community lives up to your expectations. I'm confident that you'll find something to keep you occupied here. I'm ready to tell you more whenever you want. So, now I'll inform the team that you're a registered resident, and from this moment on, all the services provided by Woodbury will be at your disposal. Woodbury is established on the site of a middle school, so there are no individual rooms left for accommodation. Most residents live in communal areas and keep their personal belongings in the storage room. If you want to have your own home, cars, and storage, we are currently working on setting up a small, safe settlement outside of Woodbury. Every one of our residents can move there if they wish. You can get one of the available plots of land right now. You know what? Let me have our guys take you to the settlement. Just head to the exit, and they'll meet you there. And if you have any questions about the land plot, you can ask me anytime. But I won't keep you any longer. Good luck. Feel free to reach out.
settling in nicely. That's great. You can come to your land plot when.